Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of Bus Simulator 21. Today you're joining us back on the Route 34, is it, that we're driving? I think it's the 34. Uh, yeah, the 34, where we're going to be driving round again, uh, round Otter Rock Dam, uh, and we need to upgrade Otter Rock Dam to level 3. Now we've already got a bus stop upgrade here, uh, where we've stopped, that's, uh, there we go, upgrade that to level 4. Don't think Otter Rock Dam. I mean, that is taking an average. What we need to remember is that's level 1 over there. That is level 2. And I think those are the only stops that we're actually missing out on this schedule. So we do need to actually raise most of the bus stops to level 4 in order to do that, if you see what I mean. Because uh, the level 1 bus stop and the level 2 bus stop are dragging the average down. Now, the mission is to upgrade it to level 3, which is doable. It's absolutely right, doable. Do and then after shopping. that, apparently, we're going to get a new bus depot and uh, some other missions, of course. Uh, right, T.O., round we go here. We might also upgrade, uh, we might be able to use different parts of the map as well, because there are two areas I think there are at, the, at this moment in time that we still haven't got access to, so we'll, uh, we'll we'll see what happens. Again, I've not played through this before, this is the first time I've ever played uh, the Bus Simulator Next Stop DLC in inverted commas, it's a free update of course to those who already own Bus Simulator 21, and the uh, the, the buses, the, um, the e-bus code pack. Uh, you can find them online, they're a DLC. So we've not managed to get you upgraded, or you. Ooh. Right, there's going to be a few there that we won't manage to get upgraded this time. God, we've got to practically go around the whole map again, haven't we? Goodness me. Uh, yeah, there's Hazel Creek down there, and Wood Falls that we've still not done anything with. So maybe we'll, uh, we'll unlock a bit of that. Right, off we go again. Oh, is that a new truck on the left there? I'm sure we didn't see those models before. It's quite a new, uh, quite a few new AI vehicles, isn't there, that are uh, sort of pottering about. Right, here we go. Okay, yeah, mom, there's nobody waiting uh, that uses a wheelchair. No, everybody is happy. Oh, hang on, you need a ticket. Right, T.O. 750, 70, 80, lovely. Heck. Can't get on quick enough, can they? Goodness me. It does make a bit of a change driving in uh, the rainy weather, although it has actually stopped raining as soon as I've said that. Oh, hang on, how are we, are we going to be able to get round here? We'll, uh, we'll, a bit of full lock. Ah, oh, with easy, easy peasy. Uh, yeah, it's nice driving in the rain, because it's obviously been very, very hot here uh, in the UK. Or it has up north, anyway. I don't know what, uh, what's been happening in the south. You must have got the wrong number. Right, there we go. Bye. Yeah, it's been very, very hot. And don't get me wrong, I love the hot weather. I would be the I last person to complain that it's too hot. Hey. Um, <laughs> I'd like to buy but a ticket, please. seeing the rain, you're just like, ooh. I mean, we, we did have a thunderstorm on Sunday night. And it was very, very nice. I enjoyed it. And then obviously it's gone back to being hot again. I think you don't mind the bad weather, do you, when there's, you know, like a thunderstorm on an evening when there's going to be good weather in the day. It just sort of freshens it up, doesn't it? Nope. Nope. Get back on your own side of the road. Flipping heck. Thought we were about to witness a head-on collision there. Right, so we're going down here again. It has been two weeks since we last visited uh, Bus Simulator 21, hasn't it? Isn't it? Obviously, with the release of a couple of new games, that's why we've uh, we've had a little gap in the scheduling. Yeah, right. Oh, put the windscreen wipers on again. You didn't mean to do that, did you? And open the doors as well. Right, hang on, why, why aren't the doors opened? There we go, they've all opened now. Bizarre. Very odd. You're getting on, love. There's space at the front for you. Nope. This is another one. I bet you any money I'm going to shut these doors and then she's going to kick off. It's going to say that I've missed a stop. You watch. No, it's not. That's bizarre. You don't normally get pedestrians just stood there doing nothing. Obviously, I think we got most of our uh, bus stops to level three last time, didn't we? So uh, that's why we need to uh, we need to go around twice for level four. But I mean, we're, we're making good time, aren't we? We can easily do that. I do think as well they have improved. I, I, 
don't know if the, it's just this route, if it's just the new DLC, but I mean, now we're not running like 10 minutes early from driving normally. If you look, we're, uh, we're actually, actually late, goodness me. And we've been driving like madmen, haven't we? Oh, we get a payday. I mean, these we've, we've already made our money back, haven't we, on these buses from the amount of paydays that we've had. Thanks. There we go. Oh, what's happening? Why are we letting everybody out? Are we going again now? Oh, no, we're not. Come on. We're going. It's our right away. This side and the uh, the side on the left there. Don't know what they're playing at. They're obviously not running to a timetable, are they? Daniel's view. I don't know who Daniel is or why we're off to view him, but uh, yep. Yeah. I actually make up a bit of time on this downhill section. Oh, why is the steering suddenly? I'm moving the wheel. I've turned the wheel to a quarter now, and the uh, the steering's gone really sort of light. Ooh, it's weird. Right, here we go. Is this the last stop? Is that why there's... Uh... Yeah, last stop. There we go. Uh, Tell you what, we're perfection. even going to go down and wake, uh, wake this person up. Where are they? Can't see them. Oh, he's here. Go on, off you get. Oh, he was a fair dodger as well. How unfortunate. Right, off we go again. With him on the bus, because he obviously wants to go around again, doesn't he? Because he's missed his stop. He can go around again with his 120... Uh, is it euros? Is it dollars? I, I can't remember what the currency is on this, to be honest with you. Uh, it's... Uh, Bus Sim's own currency, by the look of things. We've had 31.7% of charge for quite a while, haven't we? <laughs> if you look on the uh, on the dash down at the bottom right, oh no, 31.6. I wonder if you can actually run out of charge on this. Like if you keep going and keep going and keep going, I wonder if it's possible. It is one thing that you sort of don't need to consider on this, isn't it? You know, whether your bus is fueled or not. Right, round we go. Yep, that chap back there is holding on. Sounds like he's on the phone. Either that or he's just talking to himself. quite good that you get the uh, the little ambient sounds in the background. I mean, I don't necessarily need someone telling me all about the cats and how the cats like to take the bus and all that nonsense, but, you know, having him in the background, like, you can't make out what he's saying, but you can just hear a bit of chatter. That's that's nice. I always like uh, when you get that on. Oh, for crying out loud. Oi! Pack it in. <laughs> that's, that's stern, Joe. That's about as stern as we get. Right, back we go again. Come on. Now I've slowed down. It takes forever to get up to speed on this thing. Oh, there's an animal there. Which, arguably, if you look in the left-hand uh, mirror, ran into me. That's sort of, uh, sort of a bit harsh, isn't it? That they penalise you for uh, for the animal running into you. Yeah, if I'd have hit them head on, then uh, then yeah, fair dues. But by the time I saw them on the left-hand side, it was a little bit late for me to stop, and they ran into me. It's a good job we don't worry about money on this game, isn't it? We've got that much money, it's uh, coming out our eyebrows. You want a ticket? Have we not upgraded that yet? Is that another one? Ah, right, so it's from the next stop. Student one trip, three, twenty. Yes. Right, there we go. Away we go. Oh yeah, just just pull in front and slam on. That's absolutely fine. I 
thought he was going for it as well, this second chap. I mean, to be fair, if he'd have got his foot down, he could have uh, could have easily got away in front. So I would like to drive this bus until it runs out of uh, electric and just see what happens. I mean, I know that the video's not going to be that long, is it? But, yeah, I'd, I'd absolutely love to see what happens if it runs out of electric. I reckon, and this could be me being a bit cynical, I reckon when it gets down to zero, it'll just go back to 100% and it'll go round again. But, yeah, it would be good if it broke down. Well, obviously, it wouldn't be good if it broke down because nobody wants to break it down, but it'd be good if, like, you had to actually keep an eye on that and, and consider it, if you get what I mean, like... Oh, hang on. Oh, servicing stops awards them with points. I know, I've been playing this game for over a year. There we go. Right, so we've got that. We've not got an upgrade, though. Although that was level 4 anyway, wasn't it? So it's it's fine. 50, 60. Oh, it's done that where it's just stuck with the, the upgrading noise again. Oh, it's nice they've gone to fix that in the two weeks since uh, since we've not been here. How annoying. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. Right, well, we're going to get this done ASAP, then we're going to get these upgraded as quickly as possible. This bus stops also level 4, because we've just upgraded it uh, when we started the video. So, uh, this won't see an upgrade this time. But the next bus stop hopefully should. We'll, uh, oh, hang on, wait, I thought we had... Uh, a ticket, we please. I thought we had our lights on already. Didn't look it in the mirrors. Right, hang on, 1460. Do I have a valid ticket? Someone's left a valuable item. Let's have a look. Anyway, oh, someone's left a teddy embedded in the floor. Are we? I, I, I don't quite know if we're meant to take it to them. Doesn't seem like it. We'll just hand it in at our lost property depot. That is really, really annoying, isn't it? That that noise in the background. Has anyone else experienced this bug if you're a Bus Simulator 21 player? Have you, uh, have you had this clicking noise? Right, here we go again. This should have an upgrade this time. There we go, that's what we like to see. Let's have an upgrade. Ah, oh, hey. we've done it. Level three. Oh, this campaign is really taking off. All thanks to you and your buses. The new depot is a great addition to our network. Make sure you pay it a visit. Catch you there. Since Hazel Creek is a very rural area, people mostly use their cars to get away. We should show them that taking a bus is much faster and safer and more eco-friendly. The local wildlife will appreciate it too. Right, okie dokie. So, it doesn't appear that this is going to uh, this is going to stop. So what we'll do is we'll return to the main menu. There we go. And then we'll come back into the game. And then hopefully... Yeah. Uh, are we... Yeah. Oh, there we go. Right, so you can get that dialogue again, just in case you didn't hear that the first time round. ...is much faster, safer, and more eco-friendly. The local wildlife will appreciate it too. Right, so, okie dokie, so we've got Hazel Creek, we've unlocked a lot of bus stops in Hazel Creek, that's good. Have two balance routes that only contains uh, the district Hazel Creek with a maximum of six bus stops each. Right, okay, we can do that. One, two, three, four, yep, apply, no, and then what have we got down here? One, two, three, four. Apply there. Yeah, splendid, splendid, splendid. Uh, that is the route we've just done, so we're going to delete that. And then that yellow route 34, we're going to delete that as well, because it's, it's, uh, yeah. it's nonsense, we don't want it. Now, that route 34 there, I want to add that one there. I want to add that in, because that's that bus stop that we were missing, wasn't it? And you'd... So it sort of makes sense to uh, to have that in. 
apply the changes because obviously we won't be able to do that without going up turning round like that we won't be able to do that in our little circular so what we'll do is we'll create a new route this can be the route oh it can be the route 34 as well what a stroke of luck uh, so there there yeah we'll have everything in so that's perfectly balanced but we'll put that one in just for uh, just for because I imagine that later on it's going to get me to upgrade somehow you know what I mean upgrade it all to level whatever it is so we'll uh, right we won't put buses on it we'll nip to the garage and we will buy more I mean where's the new depot it says it's there I, I've never really understood the point of having the depots like because you can do everything from here you know if you had to actually go to the depot I, I get that but given you can just fast travel everywhere it sort of seems a bit of a waste of time Does anyone else get that no Right, let's have a look. So, what have we got? I mean, we've looked at the e-bus course, haven't we? We've had a right good look at them. Uh, so, I think we're going to go for something uh, a bit more... Uh, what have we got? I can see I like the e-citaro. Let's go for an Enviro. We've not driven the Enviro in a long time, have we? There we go. Let's jump in. There we go, a nice diesel bus, of course. Oh, parking brake, yep, yeah, that will be P. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Not quite sure what's happening with the revs, because I did have it in gear. They have got rid of that really uh, bizarre sort of thing. You know when we bought the e-bus codes? It was that square, wasn't there? That's all gone now. Oh. Got no idea what, the, uh, what it's doing with all those revs. Right, we're going to shove the Enviro on there. Oh, that's going to get annoying, isn't it? Revving the knackers off it and uh, <laughs> and then setting off. I don't know why it's doing that. That really is bizarre. I like how above the water they've got the haze. I think that looks quite good. Right, so we need to transport the people there in the evening. We can easily do that, because it is the evening now. 20 hundred, uh, I would say, is the evening. Right, so round we go. We've driven up here a few times, haven't we, with the bus cutters? Come on, bus, you can do it. Oh, let's have a bit of lighting on. There we go. Oh, hang on. I was sort of hoping for maybe... That'll do. We're not remotely... Uh... <laughs> not remotely on the road there, are we? Within the markings. Oh, are we going to ground on this bit? No, weirdly enough, we did actually make it. Right, so what's our first stop? Oh, is it here? That's not like Bus Simulator to actually have our first stop as the first one we get to. Camp. Hang on a second. What's this? What's happened here? Two, three, right. There we go, that's what I wanted. What was, what was all that nonsense about? Okay, I should have perhaps... Uh, Oh, hang on, what, what, what are we doing here? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't get what, what this... Oh, because you're on the wrong side as well. There we go, that just makes so much more sense. Right, so you're all over there then, I see. Right, we're going to have to do a U-turn then. And follow the old map uh, until... Right, there we go, we'll, we'll just bit of that. Oh, that would be a tree. Oh yeah, I forgot. You, for some reason your flappy paddle won't set it in reverse. Oh, there we go. Come on, turn. Oh no. Yep. 
You've skipped to stop. I've done nothing of the sort. There we go. Good timing as well. Does this bus go there? Yes, it does. Oh. <laughs> we answered wrong. Never mind. At last, I don't need to drive myself. See, I don't know how they can say the bus will be faster than driving yourself. I mean... I'm all for a bit of marketing, but I don't think for one second that taking the bus, particularly around where we are, uh, driving is much quicker than taking the bus every day of the week. Especially on a Sunday, because we have no Sunday service. I get that it's more eco-friendly. But yeah, to be able to uh, to flog to people that actually it's quicker than taking the car, I think that you're, uh, you're, you're sort of misleading us there a little bit. Stop! Nail it. How close were we there? Flipping heck. <laughs> Very close indeed is the answer. Come on. Why has it got a car horn? That's very odd. I love my job as a nurse, but a day off sure is nice too. Come on. Go, oh, there we go. They're not in a rush either, this lot. Yeah, I always seem to remember the AI on uh, Angel Falls was always pretty good. It was... Um, we've had most of our AI issues on uh, on the other one, West uh, Seaside Valley, Sunny Springs. Oh no, Seaside Valley, definitely Seaside Valley. Oh, come on. The steering wheel's about to pop off the desk. Yeah, we've had most of our issues on uh, on Seaside Valley for the AI traffic, but it does seem since this new DLC's come out at junctions, this lot are also broken. Right, here we go. They'd better be on this side of the road. Oh, they are. That's good. What are we looking at in terms of... Have we actually... During morning or evening? Ah, right, okay. There we go. We've got some people on board now. Is it when they get off that we uh, we register them as being transported? I think it is, isn't it? It's quite a nice narrow bit of town, isn't it? I like this. As map extensions go, this looks pretty good. Oh, another bit round here. You've, uh, yeah, you've not really realised that it's it's my right of way, not yours, sir. There are no castles near here, so there's no way you can hide king. Right, here we go. Have another uh, another bit of that. Is there anybody getting off? To do with you all getting off. Someone's going in for the overtake, aren't they? In that mirror. Lady Margaret's Mon Memorial. I wonder who she was. And I wonder as well if there is actually a memorial. Oh, there seems to be. Right, okay. Oh, that's good. There's like a, a sort of thing in the park there and another doodah over there. Yeah, it's quite nice. I still don't get why the knackers rev off this thing when uh, whenever we set off. Very bizarre. Oh, 
Oh, hang on. Right. Slowly. Thud. Because it nearly rips the steering wheel out your hand whenever you go over these things. I mean, I'm all for a bit of false feedback. Oh. Hit a speed bump. We did nothing of the sort. There we go. How many have we done? 12 out of 50. Okay, we've not got a, uh, a massive amount of people on, have we? Right, what are we doing now? Student one trip. Yep, lovely. Right, where are we going now? So we're going round to the left here. Oh, it's crossed off that next bit. I reckon it's updated our map now, so we don't have to faff around with the... We're going all the way back to that stop on the wrong side of the road. Fingers crossed, anyway. Fingers crossed! Oh, we go back down to Roxanne's Diner. We did that last time, didn't we? Come on, get out of my way. Bus driver coming through. Oh, what's this place? Hazel Hotel? Let animals cross the road? When did I do that? Oh, people's heads are poking through the top of the Enviro. Excellent. <laughs> that looks sort of a bit haunted, doesn't it, the Hazel Hotel? Don't cross the road, don't cross the road! Charming. Thank you for that, love. Walks into the side of me bus. And I pick up the five. Ah, oh, it's scandalous, isn't it? Oh, we're not stopping at Roxanne's Diner anymore. Are we giving that up? Doesn't really matter if I do this, does it? If I hit the speed bump. Because there's nobody on board. I wonder why we're missing out Roxanne's Diner. Is that because I changed the side that the bus was stopping on? It might be, you know. It might be. Round we go. So you shouldn't really be able to take that corner at, at such a speed. So I say the physics of this, you are literally stuck to the road on Bus Simulator 21. You, you sort of can drive like a lunatic. And it doesn't matter because it, it is so responsive and you, like I say, you just do stick to the road. Two minutes late, flipping heck. Oh, stop! The brakes on this Enviro are garbage. Oh, thud. <laughs> oh, dear me. Yeah, we're running two minutes late. We might actually need to put in a bit of time on our route. Goodness me. Right, yo, so, what do we do? Parking brake on, ramp out, kneel the bus. Open the doors. Everybody on. Heck, she's down a ravine in wheelchair. We should be alright. She's managing. She's a strong, independent woman, this lass. Right, doors closed. Kneel. Ramp away. Parking brake off. Right, well, I think that is just about where we're going to leave it for today. I do hope you've enjoyed that. We've uh, we've moved on quickly, moved on very quickly. And, uh, yeah, in the next episode, we are going to be back in the Enviro 500. We're going to be transporting all those passengers round on this route to get up to 50 passengers transported. Uh, so do make sure that you tune in. It will be next Wednesday. I know today was a day late, but, uh, yeah, we should be back on schedule for next Wednesday. Um, yeah, if you have enjoyed the video today, please do click that like button. It's always appreciated. And if you haven't already, do make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out on any future Bus Simulator 21 content. 
other than that, as I say, thank you so, so much for watching, and hopefully I'll see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.